Well, my name is Margaret O'Neill. Thank you for sitting down, Margaret. And Thank you. Now, and so the picture you wanted to talk about was the Ennis Corti one. And tell me what you think about it. I think it's fantastic. And right. I like the shimmering of the water. Yeah. And it, it's like that in the nights with the always the bridge. And it's interesting because I, I, I waited until just enough time for the lights to come on to create that effect. Because if I'd done it any later, it would have been too dark any earlier you wouldn't have had the lights on to get the reflection yeah. so I think it oh, it's worked it's beautiful yeah. in the night good but um, I'm going to tell you about my granddad yeah great his name was James Savage yeah and he had cuts on the boat and all yeah. my uncles yeah and they fished for salmon yeah. and eels great and in the the winter they, they went to Powers Whiskey they had, right. um in oil gate that was where is that near here or? uh no it's powers in dublin oh, right. whiskey yeah. distillers yeah. and in the in all the contracts all the men from oil gate came home every summer for the they came home for the fishing season and yeah. then they went back to oil gate again oh, back oh, to see. dublin again but um there was a tragedy on the river yeah what year was that again? um just roughly i'm not about 1920s i'd okay. say um, my granddad was 19, yeah. and my granny was with him. Her name was Margaret Savage, okay. and there was no Edremine Bridge at that time. Is that that bridge there now? That's yeah. the bridge in Edremine. Yeah. There was no bridge at that time. Yeah. Um, not that one. No. They had oh, to. A different one, no, not that bridge. Yeah. Edremine Bridge, and um, there was the train station. Used, the train used to stop at a little station. Yeah past Edremind and um, they had to bring the cots over to collect the people and bring them back to Oilgate. So one August... What were the cots now? Uh, it was a flat bottom boat. Oh, I see. Cots, oh, I see. Yeah. Cots. Yeah. And um, my granddad went over for... There was five people on the boat. Yeah. And it was in August in the evening about half seven and on the book it said a squall came up yeah and it flicked the boat over right and with the result three people were drowned at the time oh, wow. um, yeah. my granny and my grandfather were the only two people that survived because my granddad was a strong swimmer yeah and there was a man called Mr. Murner and yeah. his daughter was going for her violin lesson she died she was 12 and yes, yeah. Mr. well He's related to my granddad as well, uh, a Myrna man. He had a lot of money in his pockets. Yeah. And he was brought to the bottom because um, he was going to pay the fishermen. And there was another fisherman. And it took three days for them to recover the bodies at that stage. Oh, so right, yeah. because of that, uh, Ed, they built the bridge in Edermine, a timber oh, bridge, right. to um, go over to the... It was yeah. just too dangerous. So well, yeah. yeah. It's a sad story. It is a sad and, story. Yeah. And so, but your, did your grandfather survive that? And he did, yeah. Did he they was both 19, survive, yeah. yeah. My grandmother and survived. At what age? Uh, my grandmother, I don't know what age, yeah. but my granddad was 19 at the time. Very young, wasn't it? Yeah. I mean, they were, yeah, it's interesting. Yeah. 19 now as a kid, I mean, then you were a. I know, a, a man at that yeah. time, yeah. And you, you mentioned about the castle. Yeah. In the. 1100s it was built with timber oh, right. and then in the 12 I think it's 1202 yeah. or 1212 I don't know for sure it was built in stone for to protect the town the Normans came up yeah. um, up the river okay. the, yeah so it was it's a tidal river yeah so they came and up so, so they're the ones that would have um, yeah okay. it's the Normans that yeah. took over the town it was a small town and what that would have been what year? Roughly? Um I think it's eleven forty something, okay. eleven forty five or seven I think. Uh, that. So um And when did it turn into what it is today? Um it's a funny that castle has always been um there's always people living in it. Is it? Um the Schreibers lived in it. Do you know the Schreibers I don't from know. America that oh. married into the Kennedys? Oh, was that? Oh, right. Uh, there's a story on the wall that she had. They were leaving for America, yeah. And um, they they had all their bags on the Titanic, yeah. But one of the children got the chicken pox, oh, and because she got the chicken pox, they yeah. were not allowed on the Titanic. But 
the luggage went down on the Titanic, but the, the family were I, saved. I, I'm sure they spoiled that child for the rest of their life. <laughs> <laughs> My Absolutely. God, isn't that amazing? Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Mm. And this is a good town, you know, yeah. and escorting yeah. for history. It's Anna it. and the King. Yeah. You know that film? I don't. The Tell governess. Me about that. Yeah, The King and I. Oh, was that? The governess is from up around the Ross Road. Oh, yeah. Right, right, she yeah. came from the town. Yeah. Marconi's <coughs> mom. Yeah. Um, Jemson's. That's it. Davis's mill. Very good. Oh, we have a and, great town for yeah, history. And, and in terms of the, and those buildings on the front of the picture, is there anything that. The only thing I know about the town on the hill was the very first drink I got. My dad. <laughs> Point over <laughs> Cove, sorry. The cotton tree. Item number one, Your Honour. Yeah. Yeah. Well, my my um, uncle was home from America. Yeah. And I was 15, and my dad brought me down to see him. Very good. And I had my first drink there, so. Very good. They tried to poison me. It was brandy. <laughs> <laughs> and you mentioned about the, the ballroom. The ballroom of romance. Do you want to point That's that out to me? The castle ballroom. Yeah. I think everybody met the partners in that. Yeah. But if you could get some fella to bring you to the pictures. And then bring you to the dance, you were on the pig's back. <laughs> Very good. We didn't have the money for the dance. We yeah, were trying yeah. to, there was no drink that time. We were yeah. trying to save up for the dance. Very good. And uh, if we could get someone then to bring us home with a bag of chips, we were right. <laughs> <laughs> and um, what's that now? That's now, it's actually closed now at the mm. moment. It has been. It's in the Doyle family. Because it's so. amazing in Ireland that you know that, that whole music thing with the show bands and that there's it's just a bit of a revival now. But yeah, well, every show band in the country was there. But it really was yeah. such a big thing in those yeah, years, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. We've seen it all there. Dicky yeah. Rock, very good. Joe Dolan, and the fire. yeah, fire. everybody. Indian. Yeah, <laughs> and I remember I was only small, and I think his name was um, Butch Moore. He was after winning, or he was after winning the. Eurovision Song Contest, all right. and we were all queuing for this. We were all so small, and we were all yeah. so in love with. It. Very good. That yeah, yeah. was wonderful. Yeah. So, so nice. there's, a, there's a lot of history in a, in, in Ascot today. There is, yeah. That's great. And the cathedral, our Puritan cathedral, wonderful place Lovely. to go to. Lovely. So, so that's a. It's a nice place for anybody to visit if they want a historical look at old, old Ireland. Yes, it is, and we're in a a historical reenactment group. Oh, we right. have a really good one in the town yeah. and we relive all the history. And, good. Oh, and really can, good. Can, can tourists in that come and watch your... your uh... Well, we do the Battle of Vinegar Hill on the 21st of June every year. And um, is that all publicised? It's publicised, yeah. Good. And um, yeah, we, we just go everywhere. And is know? there a Facebook page that anybody, would, if they were interested, would go to? Oh, the Enniscourt, yeah. The Anascorti Historical Reenactment Society. Okay, great. And that's, uh, you'll see it all there. So, so well, it's on very the comments, good. then I'll put a little thing about that. Yeah. So, that's great. Thank you. Now, thank you very much. No bother.